Yup, let's get original crew, man. We're back. More jolly. Ill jelly. Y'all really eat that shit? Ill jelly? What is ill jelly? We're, we're gonna find out. How do British people eat this? I don't know how y'all do half of the things y'all do. Mm -mm. I just don't. Hey, it ain't my world. We're just all living in it. <laughs> <laughs> so with that being said, before we get into it, man, make sure you check out the links in the description box. Down below. You already know where to go, man. You want to first part? All you got to do is check out down below. Also, if you enjoyed today's visuals. Like it with a thumbs up. But let's learn something new today. Ew, Jelly. Ew. Oh, my gosh. Ew. Ew. Get it? Hi, I'm Josh. I'm Ollie. I'm Bo from Sorted Food. And today we are trying Britain's first original pie and mash. Manzies. Right. First. It's the oldest pie and mash shop in the UK. Started in the 1800s. You guys have been doing this for quite a while now, and I'm amazed you've not checked this place out. I know. Yeah. We needed you to bring us here. Well, that's what I'm here for. <laughs> Let's do it. I am craving some fire match. Okay, so this place better be good. As we walked in, a policeman on the way out told us this is the best food in the world. Yeah. Well, actually, he literally said, I've been watching you. <laughs> <laughs> Barry, what are we ordering? Uh, I so presume it's quite simple. There's, no, there's, there's plenty of options. You can either have a pie, one pie or one mash, one pie or two mash. Bro, look at, look at, look at, look at the, the first item on the menu. Pie and liquor. What the f y'all look? One pie, one mash, one pie, two mash, two pie, one mash, two pie, two what mash. What the fuck is the mash? Ill and mash, jelly deal, stupid deal, cold drinks, spiral. Okay, okay, okay. What is like? What is the? All right, we finna learn, but I just want to point out the fact y'all got liquor already on the first thing on the tea menu. Tea coffee. Okay. Two pies, two mash, or two pies, one mash. Wow. Well, you can have three pies, four pies. No, that's wow. not on the, but that's not on the menu. You can just keep going. How old do you think I am, just looking at me? One, <laughs> one pie? <laughs> one pie, one mash. Yeah, I think that checks out. I think that checks out. She, she saw straight through me. <laughs> the child appetite, yeah. When we were waiting outside, I heard someone order a double double. Yeah, double double. Yeah. Oh, that sounds really good. Don't have gravy, have liquor. Don't have gravy, have liquor. Okay, I'm starving. Let's do it. How about jelly deal? Yeah, yeah can we... you don't like it? Well, I don't, but we got we do stew deals as well. Hot eels. Can we have some jellied and some stew? Yeah, yeah please. What's in the pie? Minced beef. Just minced beef. The recipe has it changed no, it's been the same. since when? 1892. Wow. Oh, that's the. That's a lot of jelly. That's a solid amount of jelly. Okay. Is the is the jelly just the uh, the stuff that's cooked in? The brine or? Just some sort of jelly. Some sort of jelly. Let's just say some sort of jelly. Come on. I don't. It hey, isn't hey. Bad. If you work here somewhere and you frown up at the items on the menu. I don't think she frowned though. She was just like no. some sort of jelly. He was like some sort. She was like. She been like I don't know the recipe. She been frowned up even when when. He didn't even say something about jelly. It may be good. Hell no. It doesn't look bad. Hell. See. Not the, I'm not talking about this. I'm talking about like just the mash lie. and the I ain't pie. Gonna lie. One mash, one pie. One the pie, typical one mash, British food don't even seem that enticing to want to try. <laughs> Let me. You talking about? I'm, like when you said mash, I'm I like, can't... all right, well, mash could be a, a reference to for something else. We really talking about potatoes. We really talking about potatoes. The pie. So I guess I guess one pie, one mash is you get one pie and one scoop of mashed potato. That ain't even appetizing. Look, baby. And what kind of pie is this? This look like some humble pie type shit. <laughs> if you know what that is. Let me. Okay. I, I'm happy. Oh, it's shepherd's pie. They fucking love shepherd's pie. <laughs> and I ain't never. I, I, I've never had shepherd's pie before. I don't even know what goes in shepherd's pie. I just know it's one I, thing y'all do. Have you ever had shepherd's pie? Oh. Uh, and it's like meat pie with meat in it? What the fuck? It has mash on the top and then the is bottom. It, is it like a beef pot? Uh, like beef beef pot pie? Like, you know, chicken pot pie? But it has mash on the top. 
No, I'm no, no, that no, that one doesn't. I know, but I'm talking about the tradition, like the regular the ones that I normally see made. What? They what have the like shepherd's the, pie. Yeah, they have like oh, all the stuff, okay. the meat and all the other juices and veggies in the bottom and then mash on the top, if I'm not mistaken. I just seen somebody make one the other day online. Uh, ain't my cup of tea. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Sure, thank you. All righty. Come on in, Barry. Wow. Ooh. I feel like I'm back at church. <laughs> it's like an altar, isn't it? It really is. It is. Yeah. Should we take a moment? Yeah. Wow. Let's reflect. <laughs> Lord, <laughs> from what we're about to receive, please protect no. us. <laughs> Don't your shag on your <laughs> I must say, it all looks delicious except for one thing. What, the jelly? The jelly. Did you watch the videos of how they prepare this as well? Yes. Yeah. Yes. yes. Hard Hardcore. Hardcore. They used to catch the eels in the Thames, right? No, it, apparently it's really they still full don't. of them. Well, the thing really? is, even back then, in the 1800s, yeah. it was still really badly polluted. Okay. It's one of the only things that could survive. Now it's so bad, there's no chance of them being in there, so I'm not sure where these are from. Oh, okay. okay. And that goes back to that comment that we got. They said the reason why, like, certain dishes, like, are, like, British staples is from the war area. Mm -hmm. I'm like, I mean, era, not area, but era. Yeah. But, uh, but, hey, it's a new new day and age, man. <laughs> hey, we can do some other things, bro. We ain't we ain't do them tiles no more. You know what I'm saying? Like beans on toast, shepherd's pie. Like, I understand stuff that can stretch, but maybe. Oh, I'm shepherd's just, pie. Yeah. I'm just complaining. I'm just complaining. You see his origin? Yeah, that's what I said. I know, baby. Oh, so mashed potatoes with minced meat. So we have your meat. At the bottom with your peas and your veggies and then the only, mash at the top. I, I don't and then you put eat, in the oven and bake it. I don't even eat uh chicken pot pie, so I'm not even like I love me a good chicken pot pie, chef. That's what she said she eating. There <laughs> is a lot She's going like, on. Ollie's got a little a little oh mini plate. <laughs> Goldilocks situation. I love the way they scrape the potato yeah. on the side. Yeah, like, excellent. Should we flip? I have had a mini of iron mash. Oh wow! In my day, it's and I different... never knew this is how they originally are supposed to be eaten. Now, this is yeah. Puff on the top, and then yeah. sue it on the bottom. Look at that! Oh, look at that! Oh, so that's like beef and gravy. Oh wow! Yeah. Look at that! It's a really basic. You got ill, like the cheapest cut. Back in the day, yeah. And then you got the Just cheapest minced beef as well. It's good quality, yeah. Yeah. but at the same time, like it's affordable. You get you get in the liquor sauce as well. Because that, yeah. as a name, concerned me first of all. Yeah, yeah. It's but it is liquor. just parsley sauce. Okay. There's no liquor. Yeah, there's no, no it's alcohol. nothing to do with alcohol. Yeah. Is it liquor? Oh. No, no, it's just parsley, parsley sauce. Okay, so oh. Beckham told us liquor was here. What does Beckham know about? Oh, it's his favourite food, apparently. Yeah, right. Yeah, apparently. What I grew up on was traditional pie and mash from the east end of London. Okay. So it's a mince pie, mashed potato. Okay. And then it's called liquor. So liquor is oh. parsley and stew deals. All right. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Okay. That is the biggest Solid name drop I've ever heard in my life. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, <laughs> Beckham. You told us this on the. Uh... Like, okay, certainly we, they could I'm, put I'm, liquor in it. I'm educated. We, we're being educated. That's all. It's education. So if you come in pre previously about it, just delete your comment. It's, we all are being educated. I'm not from the UK, so I won't <laughs> understand. Because I was when I was looking at the meat, I'm like, sure. But I know not... they love. They I know they I know they love their beer. They love their liquor. Well, because a little child won't be able to eat it. I ain't seen no child go in there and eat it. I know, baby. Just on the video. I'm just... <laughs> I was saying if it actually had liquor in it. Second occasion that we had dinner. <laughs> 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 you might get a little sippity sip too. Mm. Mm. <laughs> 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 Ooh, what's that? Very mm. 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 It doesn't taste of mutt right now, it's warming. That tastes brown. Soul food. It tastes beige. It does taste beige. I eat it without it. Yeah. It tastes slightly good. green. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Yeah, but not, not, not too green. No, no, no. no, no you will want that. Okay. Okay. A bit of salt. And <laughs> Ollie, bruh. Ollie. I a, he, he, for me. I know. Uh, we didn't watch <laughs> no to see the way Ollie responds. Well, he really likes something. Something is nasty know. depending on his. Bro. I will get the pie and the mash. I just want the, none of it. the liquor. I won't get none of it. Stuff. I won't get none of it. Just honest. He already had to get some salt. And I mean, he ain't got no salt. I wonder does the potatoes have like any like flavor? Salt and pepper and stuff. <laughs> They just look really bland. And that motherfucking police, I said, this is the best food in the world. <laughs> I mean, yeah, to, 
tell you, you, you never trust a pig. You and never you trust a pig. Shut up. You gotta understand. Everybody taste buds are different. Which They're is used true. To what you used to. Which is true. Ain't nothing wrong with it. It's just all jokes. Yeah. Vinegar. Look at the size of that bottle of vinegar. I've never seen anything like that. Chili vinegar. Yeah, chili vinegar. Chili vinegar, vinegar. and okay. chili vinegar. So it's just. Now that is something I never. Wow. Knew was no. a thing. There's a British version of like chili oil in Italy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, is it? Oh, oh my gosh! <laughs> on the plate would have been useful. Wow. Let's give it a go. Not having a, kn a knife is bothering me slightly. Yeah, but I know. Like, she was very, very clear that knives were not allowed. Oh, wow. Wow. Is it better? Mm. That's yeah, that's completely different. Okay. It lifts it. Mm. Yeah, I'm not surprised well, you like that. Well, there's actually something to it. It tastes like a pack of salt and vinegar it does. almost. It does. Which is <laughs> always my favourite thing in the world. It's a like salt and vinegar soup. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. The crispy puff pastry top is kind of needed because everything else is just the same texture. Yep. Now it's got the vinegar in it in particular. Mm. It yeah. almost like unlocks the whole flavour. For me, it's very similar to what fish and chips does. In terms mm. of you bring someone over, Welcome to my country. I'm always a little bit embarrassed by going try yeah. fish and chips because I it's not the finest of dining. Yeah. I've got plenty of friends who have this on a semi-regular basis. Yeah. yeah. And they're almost like I don't want to get my friends over because they might judge me for it, but I really love it. I, I, I get what he said. Like, because to be honest, if I go to the UK and I'm like, hey, treat me, oh, would you like some fish and chips? Nah, I can get that in America, bro. Like, show me something. Something else. It might not be of the best quality because. Every place got different qualities, yeah. of, you know what I'm saying? But we just ate fish and chips yesterday. Literally. Oh, we did. Like, literally, ate, we ate fish and chips yesterday. So, so, mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. so, if somebody came to America, say, for instance, they've never been here before. Please don't ask me what I want to take them. What would you give them? Like, hey, this could be a good representation of just not America, but my area of America. i take them back home and, and have them a home-cooked meal. Nah, nah, nah. I'm talking about a dining experience. Oh, dining experience. Like, just, you would, you, would you take him go get My. some, get some okay. fried chicken, get some wings, give him a good burger? Some barbecue. Some barbecue? Mm. Oh, you going that. You going mm. that route. No fish and spaghetti? No catfish? That, now, catfish. I would. Is, I would I you wouldn't know take, exactly where to take him. I wouldn't take him nowhere, nowhere else, like a restaurant, get fish and spaghetti. Well, I mean, I just, well, to, just catfish. Catfish? I know a spot. Maybe. I, know, I know a spot back home. But I gotta, if I really I gotta want them to show to. them like something I like, it will be fish and spaghetti. I gotta take you to the and spot that back home. Catfish. You gotta try that. I and think if y'all ain't never well, I don't know who will be watching this, but fish and spaghetti is uh together. A lot of people a lot of people if you're not from the, You gotta eat it together. Like the, the Mississippi Delta area. You not my fish and spaghetti go like together. <laughs> like to, but yeah. Fish. But uh I gotta take you take you there. Okay. I never took you there before. But definitely but barbecue. Like, we don't ever be home during that time, though. But yeah, definitely barbecue. Maybe some good catfish somewhere. Um, Maybe some good wings or something like this that. It's very hard. It's very hard, but but something like that. Or just a home cooked meal. Or not even a good burger. Oh, I got a good burger spot. Too, but see, I'm not a big burger <gasps> person. I got a good barbecue spot. Backyard. Just, just some quick. <laughs> British soul food, really. Well, yeah. It is a window into our soul, maybe. <laughs> maybe. <laughs> maybe. I get really nervous when I see you, when I watch you think. I know you're searching for yeah, 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 yeah. British soul food. Know. You never know. Oh, you also never know what he's going to surprise you with. <laughs> <laughs> Turns out he's going to have written an autobiography about you without you knowing. Okay, so now Ducky has never tried pie and mash before. And I should just say, like most pies you get in the UK now, they come with gravy yeah. instead of liquor. They're not quite this simple. I like but I'm going to let you taste this without putting any vinegar or anything on it first. I get the feeling Ducky's had some of the finest food in the world. Yeah, well, Ducky's been with, <laughs> Ducky's been with us uh, eating our way around the world, yet has somehow still never had a British pie and mash. Really okay. it up. <laughs> big mouth. Yeah, it was a very big mouthful. <laughs> 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 you went all in. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, no. <laughs> so, do you like salt and vinegar crisps? Yeah. Okay, good. All right, well, imagine salt and vinegar crisps with like a really, really mushy, warm texture. 
better. That is better. Okay. okay. Better. Way better. Okay. okay. You prefer that? I mean this. It tastes like something that was invented 200 years ago and hasn't been changed since. True. So True. I realised, Luke, you haven't had any pie yet. Do you want some pie? Wow. Well, you are hand feeding a whole <laughs> pie. It's fine. It's just a little bit juicy. Yeah, it is a little bit juicy. Very okay. juicy. Come on, Luke's gonna be on my side. Come on. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, no. Okay. It is good. I wanna know why. I wouldn't have it every day because I've been trying loads of fruits from around the world because mm -hmm. the palate's expanded, mm -hmm. but mm -hmm. I could always go back to that. I know when Adam's. And that's what I was thinking, especially with Ali, because Ali done had so much. Like, I mean, Josh has too, but yeah. Ali was like, I need mean, something else. After, after, after you've been around the world. All types of flavors and yeah. stuff like that. Like when you have something bland, even if you were used to growing up on it, like mm -hmm. you grew up on it, when you have other things, when you try other things, and you go back to that, you're like, damn, I was eating this all this time. Like mm -hmm. it just tastes super like Boom. something's missing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Especially like, cause I said they do have they like uh, like a Korean channel as well. Yeah. We don't react to it, but they do have a Korean channel, and. Asian cultures use a lot of spices and flavors mm -hmm. too. Not only in America, we like especially down south where they be they really be in down south. Yeah. Down south really use a lot of spices and flavors. Yeah, and um, so and then one another thing I was thinking about while watching, I'm like, all right, like, and I heard him use the term British pie, mm -hmm. and because I'm like, what do I wonder what do they call like, what would they call like our type of pie? Well, like what type of pie? Like any pie, like because when you pie. say the term pie, most people in America are gonna automatically go to dessert. Yeah, they're not thinking chicken pot pie or a, a shepherd's pie. pie. They're automatically thinking, oh, we're gonna have pie today. You will be like, oh, oh, apple pie. It, then you'll be like, that's all. Like, <laughs> what else we gonna have? Today. No, I'm gonna fix a pie for us to eat. Okay. Okay, what type of pie? So that's dessert. So what are we gonna eat? Regular right food. It's gonna be a pie. You'll be like, motherfucker, I don't want no damn. Pie. So what type of pie? You yeah. gonna like? You gonna do a chest pie? You gonna do a, a buttermilk? It's <laughs> pumpkin pie. You gonna do a, a pecan pie, or you gonna do a, a sweet potato pie, lemon, a key lime pie? Like what we doing? Yeah, I feel. So you, you got like different versions, and they be like, not or a chocolate pie, mm. or a humble pie. Oh gosh, <laughs> please. Look at humble pie. <laughs> yeah. It's very, very distinctly British. <laughs> no, it's no, it's not. It's not hor horrible. I guess you're right. There's a nostalgia to it. You feel part of yeah. something. But also, that's a fiver. Yeah. Important. Wow. Important. No clarification. Yeah. Like that's a full meal that's for a five. You can pay. You can pay like twenty quid in for London. Pie mash in a gastro pub. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. This was next to our office. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Once this, a week. This is around yeah. the corner from our office, and one of the girls in our team comes here every week. A double pie, double mash. Wow. I think I would go for the single mash next time. I don't <laughs> think I really... Because it's have a range yeah. around the edge. I don't think I really realised how it's like much a tsunami mash of that is. I mean, it's, it's literally... I think it's just potato. There's very little butter or dairy True. in that. And I don't yeah. think any salt either. Yeah, yeah it's unseasoned. Yeah. I think that's, that is a, actually an interesting thing about English food is often, and we had this growing up, you guys probably had it with your parents too, yeah. often a meal is reasonably or, or almost completely unseasoned yeah. and yeah. then you have salt and pepper on yeah. the table and you season yeah. to your own taste. Yeah. Which my wife Gabby was quick to point out, that's not really how <laughs> cooking works. It, you, you, know, you usually have to season the food while cooking it in yeah. order to unlock yeah. all the flavours. Yes. But, but, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> as, as but our flavours walked away. I grew up in like north of London. And then, hey, and they travel too though, because I ain't gonna lie. Like typically when you do like, just in American culture, say for instance, I grew up going to one of my white friends' house. The type of food, <laughs> The flavor is not, and I'm like, all right, they came with y'all. I understand <laughs> the, the, the lack of usage of flavor. Now, don't get it twisted. Not everybody is like that. Because I, the, because you everybody. always talk about your experience, like growing up with whatever. But I have experiences too. And I get, now well, bacon, we're both down south though. So I, I can't bacon, even use that as a thing. Bacon, y'all got that like cover, man. Shit, I love, love white women bacon. <laughs> Hey, hey, especially the older white women, they can bake their ass off, though. I'll just be like, 
Fuck, that shit good. <laughs> no, other food, I'm like. <laughs> I've had some good food though, like. like but you know something? I be well. I don't know if it's because now since we have such no disrespect, but it's just, yeah, it's just fun. It ain't nothing. But like but you said what? But I I don't know if it's because now we have the internet that's teaching a lot of things now because yep. I be seeing videos of like you know Bro, that one girl like, <laughs> that one girl that be cooking for her dude. They engaged she, now. Yeah yeah yeah. I saw her engaged. She be throwing down. Throwing down. I ain't gonna I lie. I be like, I gotta do that recipe. Yeah yeah. I be cooking though. So she be shut yeah. up. But yeah. Anyway. She she, she got like the the old southern soul mm -hmm. food type shit, but yeah, but not nah, like like no joke though. Like but bacon, cupcakes, cookies <laughs> type shit. They just be making a joint from scratch. I be like, y'all really know how to use the measurements? Cause sometimes grandma could be over over. Baby, you just you ain't no measure. You just you be like that's a lot of sugar though. But the one oh white women be like that's enough sugar for you. That's all you need because that that chocolate chips gonna enhance. You be like damn, <laughs> it's the right amount of chocolate chips. We go grandma be like damn, she was fucking sweet too. Though. <laughs> I was about to play with you. Too much sugar. I have many friends who like are in the building trades or so on who, who yeah. swear by these pies. They still be like you gotta try the eels. Yeah. Oh. Well, on that note, let's do it. Let's try some eels. Never. <laughs> you go first. Worried. Okay, so this is stewed eels, which I've never had. And again, we let it sit I'm, for a little bit. Very rarely wow. get it served food with a gag and a warning of don't choke on the bone. Yeah. 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 Okay. So the first time I ever had jelly eels, absolutely disgusted. Oh, oh it's juice! This juice. Um, I then watched a few videos of like Beckham really enjoying them and other people actually liking the eels. And, uh, have you been Beckham before? Uh, yeah. You should have yeah. mentioned it. You should have uh, mentioned yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. I, 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 I don't like to say, but uh, <laughs> <laughs> I can't, can't go. I can't have a one over. All right. Oh, oh. I think it's mm -hmm. the ball. Oh, oh. Uh -huh. That's the ball. It's the gag. The gag. The gag. Very sharp bones. Very sharp. Wow. Big gag. I forgot how like sharp the bones a are. Bunch of pins. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, I tell you what, this flavour, it's not, it's not great flavour. Oh, yeah, lovely. No, it's lovely. <laughs> you can't accuse that of being bland. Oh, There's oh. a bone. Yeah. A little oh, bone. Oh. <laughs> okay. 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 Yeah, so, I would never. Right, let's start. Before. I've had fish like that before, and I, I hate the fact that you got to sit there and do this the whole time you eat. Like, I, back okay. in the day, I used to eat fish with bones all the time. I could never. Well, I was a child, I but my mama like like she'll literally sit there and pick all the bones out for me. Bro, that's but you still have to be careful. She's like, be careful just in case I miss one. And I'm like, bro, and I just want to so, enjoy my food. They're so and tiny and fine. I just want to enjoy my food. I ain't got time to be making sure I'm not swallowing the bone. Bro, I've had a couple times. I didn't swallow bone before, and they got it, and they like get a piece of bread, roll it up, and just swallow <laughs> it. And it's gonna, it's, it's gonna, go down. And it's gonna go down. And it's gonna pull that bone right along with it. I'm like, I ain't got time. After I choked on that one bone. Never again. Mm -hmm. Never again. Ow. Yeah, let's dissect that. That's what we do, okay? Okay. Super meaty. Okay. okay. Yeah. In terms of like back in the day, yeah. bang for your buck. It's yeah. cheap cut of meat. Oh, yeah. Really meaty. As far as seafood goes, maybe the meatiest. Yeah, probably yeah. so. Very, um, very meaty. Still got a bone in my, in my throat, which yeah, is really annoying. Yeah, careful about that. Yeah. My biggest problem with that actually was the texture of what it's in. It's like this slimy liquor sauce mm. that then you bite through expecting to hit something hard, but there's nothing hard until you hit both. Right, jelly. All right, jelly. Okay, okay. Jelly, maybe it'll be better. We do this thing on our show okay. where we play, uh, do poker face. I want to eat this and no expression whatsoever. No Down the camera, reaction. no reaction. Okay. okay. Wow. Let's see, so. see who can hold it the longest. Oh, gosh, it's oh my goodness. Goodness. Sorry, it's great. It's, it's good triggering my like, gaggy Cheers. Cheers. Wow. Baby, I'm Ollie, child, because, uh... Why is my eye twitching? <laughs> he talking about no nose. His eyes already gave me. Or maybe I'm here. Oh. Who's this is that berry? Yeah. Ooh. Oh, Josh already failed. Wow. Ooh. Uh, Ollie. Ooh. Ooh. Ollie. 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 I don't, ooh, I don't he know. already from the jump <laughs> failed. Oh my gosh. His eyes already saw me. Oh! Yeah. Do you swallow? The, je the jelly is the, while, the yeah. jelly is the hardest bit. It's so yeah. gelatinous. So I initially first bite, I way preferred that to that. I think I did. I I prefer Actually, the jelly. I agree. I agree. Because you you can taste the 
isn't it? A bit more of a bitey, you, mm. the meat's got a bite to mm. it. But we have a lot of eels in Korea, and grilled, mm. and it's beautiful. Mm. One of my favorite things to eat. And you've got a little hint of that. Mm. That's really enjoyable until then the texture of the jelly. It's the jelly. You bite the, jelly the meat, and then all the texture yeah. of the jelly and is the, left. The jelly holds a lot of the fishy flavor. Yeah, it does. Yeah. It does. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that, that flavor and that texture don't belong together. That's true. I, like, you think about it, yeah, that jelly, like, jelly and eels, you know, it just so don't psychologically mm, make sense. Yeah, I wouldn't be able to do it because I'm very, like, textured. Oh, you, yeah, you most definitely. I couldn't do that. <laughs> Uh, they don't. I'd say the jelly deals. I think I have preferred it to that than the stew deals, like significantly. Oh yeah, hundred yeah. percent. They're like, yeah, I, I, that is borderline inedible. Yeah. I would say maybe just cook it a different way. Mm -hmm. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't tasted one too much. Wow, Barry, that has been a real experience. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm glad uh, I've introduced this to you. Yeah, um, I'd like to have a go at making this ourselves. Like, Ooh. make your own to it. Puff pastry, filling, liquor, seasoned mash. Yeah. You can a make that amazing. Butter, Do we finish on a positive? I think so. I yeah, think so. We well, if, if we didn't, go over to sorted food. We we look we uh, we can turn anything to a positive. Yeah, they can turn it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean you've been doing that for a while, right? Yeah, nearly fifteen nearly yeah, fourteen years. Oh, than ours. Wow. Yeah. Have you sorted it all? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> right, come on, look. Sorted as a yes. word, in one sense it can be to get things organised. That's not the meaning we apply to it. That was the joke I was. I know, and it's frustrating me because okay. you make it every okay. single okay. time I see you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you guys always jolly? Pretty much, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's kind of my thing. <laughs> I still could. I would try the pie and the mash. I'll just need to season the mash a little bit. And I like my mashed potatoes like super creamy. And those look a little stiff. There was nothing added to it. So but got, I guess you, that's why because there's nothing got, added. Yeah. But the like potatoes, you know. Yeah. That's why. Get what you at? Uh, whatever. Yeah. I don't know what's added. But yeah, I would definitely try the pie though. <sighs> with a little salt and pepper. I'm a person I wouldn't try either. None of it. Uh, but not with that just, liquor stuff. I, I don't want to eat chicken pot pie, so, yeah. No. Oh, I tried the one with the gravy that they showed, the little picture of, because I love gravy. Still, no. It's, mm. it's enough for me, big dog. <laughs> uh, so, with that being said, spell us up in the comments. Let us know y'all thoughts about it in the, in the comment section <laughs> down below. But it's always... <laughs> I do go with the name, DJ Kid. This is Yarn. 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 Yarn.